From the very heart of Mexico, Venustiano Carranza governed for three years. In 1920, the time having come to choose his successor, and in order to curb militarism, he blocked the presidential candidacy of Álvaro Obregón, the revolution's most celebrated general, endorsing instead a civilian, Ignacio Bonillas. The Sonoran generals, Elias Calles and De La Huerta, Obregón supporters, disavowed Carranza's government and rose up in arms. In an attempt at resistance, Carranza moved his government to Veracruz, but his train was attacked and he was forced to continue the journey on horseback. He and his entourage went deep into the Sierra until they reached Tlaxcalantongo, where that evening a shootout took place. At the end of the chaos, Carranza's lifeless body was found. It was May 21, 1920. Carranza had fulfilled his historic role, defending the rule of law and handing down the legal framework of revolutionary Mexico. 200 years of being proudly Mexican. This is the Bicentennial.